Hello, brothers and sisters. I hope you're having a wonderful and blessed day today. My name is Joelle, if you're new, and in today's video, I guess I want to, hopefully, God willing, encourage you and, and give you some hope that you might find some comfort in what I'm about to say. So, there is great comfort and joy and healing in Jesus Christ. I know that because I suffered a lot in my life. I would say the majority of my life I spent suffering. I was hurt by a lot of people which taught me how to love myself or not love myself. And this produced habits, passions in me that made me inflict harm on myself in so many areas of my life. I held on to a lot of pain and I allowed it to shape my worldview and how I viewed others and myself. When Jesus Christ came into my life, he embraced me in a love that I never knew before. It's like, it's like I received the first warm hug that I ever had in my life. God loves us so much. And it really does not matter the background that you had before Christ. All of that washes away the moment he embraces you. You become someone new. His touch brings to life what was dead. I was dead and he revived my soul. I am eternally grateful to God for all that he has done in my life. Not only did he revive my soul, but he taught me true forgiveness. He taught me what it means to forgive. And that's not to say that forgiveness happens overnight. It doesn't, especially with things that are deep pain, especially with things that bring deep pain. Sometimes you need to forgive over and over and over and over again. But every time you do, you release a little more of that pain till eventually you are free from it with only the memory lingering. I know this story is quite vague as I didn't give the details of what my suffering and pain was, but it doesn't matter because each one of us has a different story and yet the pain and suffering is the same. I tell you this because it doesn't matter what particular story you have, Jesus is greater than that. A 
I wouldn't want you to think that because your suffering isn't as great as mine, that Jesus Christ still can't give you comfort, or if that your story is worse than mine, that Jesus Christ couldn't give you comfort. No matter what your story, Jesus Christ can transform your life with one warm hug. Brothers and sisters, I hope you have a wonderful and blessed day today. And I'll see you guys again next time.